Welcome to our program, The World of Cell Biology. Today, we are going into the cell to take a closer look at the nuclear import process. Yo, mic check, mic check. Yeah, here you go. Oh, nah, he, he over here. Yeah, I heard he got that hot new thing. It's called Switch. Let's get it going. First, we must go through the lipid bilayer. Inside the cell, we see that nuclear transport is about to occur. Watch as the important beta receptor binds specifically to the NLS on the cargo protein in the cytoplasm. This process can also happen in combination with an adapter protein, such as important alpha. Now we see docking, where the important complex binds to the cytoplasmic filaments of the nuclear pore. This complex is transferred through the pore. The import complex now encounters RAN GTP, which binds the important beta and causes the release of the cargo protein. RAN GTP remains bound to the important beta transport receptor and brings it back out of the nucleus through the nuclear pore. RAN GTP is now hydrolyzed by GAP in the cytoplasm, which is GTPase activating protein. This results in the conversion of RAN GTP to RAN GDP. RAN GDP dissociates from the receptor and the process starts again. Now let's take a closer look at the activation of RAN GDP in the nucleus. RAN GDP is converted to RAN GTP by a G protein exchange factor, GEF. 